In this specific video, you're going to learn how to embed video on your WordPress site for better site rankings. So this method alone, while it is very small and is quick and easy to implement, can actually be very, very powerful in ranking your WordPress post on Google or any other search engine. Now, the whole idea is about consistency, being consistent in your WordPress post and in your video. And I'll explain a little bit more in a few moments what that means. The first thing you're going to need is to have your keyword phrase that you want to rank on. So I would assume that at this point, you've already done the proper keyword research. You know exactly what keywords that you want to rank on. So what I'm going to do in this example is hop on over to YouTube. Let's say, for example, that I am creating a WordPress post and I want to rank something related to golf, like how to improve your golf swing. So what I do is I go to YouTube and type in how to improve golf swing. Now, I would highly advise you to use your own video if all possible because you will need to customize your video to your WordPress site and WordPress post. Now, like I talked about earlier, consistency is important. So let's say, for example, that you've done your keyword research and your keyword is how to improve your golf swing in 30 days. So all in reality, your, your keyword is really how to improve your golf swing in 30 days. But if you add on in 30 days, let's say that's your, your video. So what you need to do is hop on over to your WordPress dashboard and go to create a new post and make sure that the keyword is in the title. So how to improve your golf swing is the keyword that I want to rank on. However, you want to add other stuff to it. So consistency means that it needs to be in your title of your post as well as in the content. Now your goal here is obviously not the keyword stuff and trick the system and trick Google. In fact, when Google comes to your site and they see that you have keyword stuffed your content and, and that means that how to improve your golf swing is is seen over and used over and over and over again. So the key here is to use it once in the title, once in the content. So as you can see here, I created some content and in this article, you are going to learn how to improve your golf swing in 30 days. Now I would put that up here. I would put that up at the top here and I would bold it and after this point I don't want to use too much of learn how to improve your golf swing because I don't want to keyword stuff the content and look like I'm doing that so you can also refer to the video on LSI content you can create uh, LSI content which will allow you to get better rankings in combination with this method but using this method once you have Put this here and learn how to improve your golf swing in 30 days. You also want to go down to the categories and create some categories in relation to that keyword as well as tags. Now in relation to a YouTube video, you will want to create a YouTube video that has this keyword, how to improve your golf swing. That needs to be in the title. So for example, this video here will buy expert village. You'll notice that if we go here, what you'll need to do is, as you can see here, it says how to improve your golf swing tips for improving golf swing. 
So if you can put a shorter version of your keyword here and then a longer version of the keyword here, then you have the keyword in variations at the title and the top. So the purpose here is consistency. So make sure that keyword phrase is in the title of the video and also whenever you write the description in your video, make sure that you put the keyword here first and then put like a description. So in this case, we would say something in this video, you're going to learn how to improve your golf swing in 30 days. Here's a video. And if you want to learn more, then point people in that video back to your post or to your site or whatsoever. And in this case, you would embed this video and copy that and you would paste it here. And to paste it, all you need to do is go to HTML and just copy the code near the words. And if you're using an order list, you will need to put it within these characters here. But if you're not using a list, that's a little more simpler. But if you go to visual, you'll notice that we have the video on the page. Now, when Google comes to your site, they read the title. They see the title is, or the keyword phrase is in the title and the keyword phrase is in the body of the content. They also see that there's a video and guess what? YouTube is owned by Google and they look at your video and they see that the video is actually relevant. And the video has the same keyword phrase as well as the description. And they can see that the keyword phrase is basically everywhere and that you, everything is relevant and consistent. So that's a small method, but a powerful one that you can use right away to increase your rankings on Google.